Hi guys, this is Nathan Chandra. In this video, I'll be showing how to create a donut chart uh, using Photoshop CS5. Uh, uh, you might be creating an um, application or a mobile app where you want to show a pie chart or a donut chart. Uh, I'll be showing uh, how to how to make this uh, graphical representation very easily on um, uh, Photoshop. So let's get started with this. Uh, I'm, I've already launched my Photoshop CS5 uh, version. Um, I'll just say new file new I'll keep the width custom width as 1280 uh, 280 by 800 and I'll keep the resolution by 72 um, you can you can select whatever you want based on your requirement I'll just say okay okay once you say okay you will be having um, you will be having a canvas uh, where uh, you can play around uh, the first and foremost thing I'll uh, will create a circle uh, Circle can be created using um, uh, Eclipse tool. Using you, you can use the shortcut also as you. you can see over here. I'll just select Eclipse tool. Hold Shift key and just drag. Just drag a, a big circle. Oh, sorry. Uh, you will be having a shape layer here. I'll just make it, I'll rename it as circle 1. Circle 1. Okay. Okay. So, I'll just duplicate this layer using Ctrl J. You'll have another layer on this, on the base layer and I'll name that layer as uh, circle 2. And I'll change the color of the circle 2 to white. So I, I'll be using a free transform tool. I'll just take uh, Control T and uh, hold Shift. I'm sorry, hold Alt. Okay. So once you once you do uh, like this, and you'll have um, you'll uh, I'll, uh, you'll be having a two two layers of uh, circle. One is a small uh, circle two layer, and uh, another is circle one layer. I'll just say enter. You can free transform the tool using um, a control T and um, you can uh, uh, re reduce the size of the circle using alt. Okay. Uh, so I'll select circle 1 first and uh, we'll have, uh, we'll have uh, multiple sections of uh, do uh, uh, there will be a multiple sections in do donut chart. So um, I'll be using different colors to represent multiple layers. Uh, okay. So next thing is uh, select, um, select a pen tool. Make sure you select you have selected the circle one layer first, and then use a pen tool. Just select two points. Okay. I'll complete this layer like this. I'll change the color to uh, maybe orange. So once you once you do like this, you'll have a, sh a shape another shape uh, on on the on um, on base of circle one layer. I'll just name it as um, orange. Okay. Once you name it as orange, just click on the layer and select select Alt and just drag the drag your mouse over on the edges of the two layers, like in the in between circle circle one and orange. You'll be finding a uh, uh, two circle, two circles, which is saying a kind of masking thing. Masking thing. Just uh, when you when you find that uh, icon, you just click on click on your um, mouse, uh, and it will be have it will be masked over your uh, circle one, circle one layer. The orange layer is masked over on your circle one layer, so you'll get a a part of your donut chart. Likewise, I'll be creating multiple sections, multiple sections in the donut chart. Just uh, just have a look at it once and um, let me know if you have any questions I'll say I'll add another layer I'll make it a big one oops sorry okay. complete like this I'll change the color maybe to red Uh, 
selected. Okay. Likewise, I uh, again I have uh, selected shape. Uh, I'll change the name to red. I have se I have selected red layer and I'll click Alt. And once I get the uh, mask icon, I'll just click uh, click on the mouse. Uh, it will be mask over the uh, orange and um, uh, th that is in turn mass over the circle one. Likewise, you can create a multiple sections in uh, multiple sections of the donut chart. I'll just complete the donut chart by different uh, different colors. Okay. color to blue. Done. Add another color, a green color. darker one okay fine so likewise you can create a donut chart um, if you have like uh, likewise you can create a pie chart also like I've, uh, I've, I've created a circle inside another one so if I if I remove that circle it will be a kind of pie, pie chart but if you be careful uh, while uh, while while doing uh, coordinates or no, uh, using pen tool. Uh, you can create a pie chart using like this. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, please let me know if you know, if you have any questions. To so know more about me, you can visit www.netinchandrasa.com. Thank you.